if aliens were coming to our planet there seems little doubt that they would stop at the moon on their way here the moon itself is kind of the eye in the sky NASA says that the moon is apparently hollow during the Apollo missions uh, the command module crashed into the moon and the moon rang like a bell for hours there are craters on the moon which they cannot find bottom to and it's thought by some researchers that these bottomless craters are entrances inside our moon the whole enigma of the moon gets weirder and weirder the more you know it was the moon actually brought here from another solar system and put into orbit around our planet biologists say that life on this planet could never have occurred without our moon and the reason for that is that the moon creates the tidal effect and without the effect of tides and this rhythmic motion on the oceans life would never have begun on this planet in my mind the evidence is there that the moon is a gigantic spaceship in orbit around our planet it's occupied by some extraterrestrial race in many ways it's much like the George Lucas Death Star concept in Star Wars where they're building this artificial moon that's capable with technology of actually destroying a planet but if alien beings are using the moon as some sort of satellite for earth observation why what would be the purpose and where is the proof they would like to see us evolve you know they are great masters great um, avatars they are of a very high and so are we and we need to live up to our potential we really need to live up to our potential for all people and today we are living still as if we are alone in the universe while hundreds and thousands of people are seeing unusual craft in the skies as they did 5,000 years ago and so in a way the idea that the ancient aliens would finally be coming around full circle all the way into the 21st century as trying to push open a truth that governments have suppressed in the 20th century is really very ironic.